of that incident, local officials are warning residents about the dangers of high water levels. CBS 47's Angelica Leilani joins us live in Fresno with more Angelica. Well, this canal here near McKinley and Clovis may be gushing partially with water flowing through it right now, but right now rivers and creeks and even backcountry roads are flooding with water because of the excess rainfall and snow melt this season. Now, deputies say the water is very dangerous because you never know what's lurking underneath. It's a story we report on most summers, people drowning and getting swept away by rushing water. And it can happen to you in your car. In fact, it almost did to this group of men on their way to work this morning while trying to cross the San Joaquin River, something they've done before, but this time they got stuck. It's a little deceptive how fast that current moves and how strong it is. Officials say it's a dangerous gamble. Just six inches of water can knock you down. Two feet can sweep your car away. This year we've had unprecedented rainfall, and as it gets warmer, um, that the snow is going to start melting and we're going to see a lot more uh, water runoff and um, you have to be really cautious when you're crossing roads. Sergeant Matthew Hamilton with the search and rescue team says the risk is greatest on unmaintained roads. He says every year they get a handful of calls. You never know how powerful that water can be and it could just, uh, just a little bit of water going across the road can uh, wash a, a car down the road. But Hamilton says it's not just flooded roads that are dangerous. Trees can be as well. Recently, deputies pulled out chainsaws cutting down trees blocking roads to save people we're stuck. Trees have not been cleared. And so when there's a lot of snowpack and a lot of weight on the trees, we tend to have trees fall across those roads. And officials say, again, it's better to not go down any unmaintained roads. They say if you do go down a backcountry road, to be prepared with extra water and food and clothes. And they say it's also good to make sure you have cell phone service. Reporting live in Fresno, I'm Angelica Leilani, CBS 47 Eyewitness News.